The weight loss industry is full of myths. Most people are being told to do all sorts of crazy things, most of which have no evidence behind them. Fortunately, researchers have found a number of strategies that are actually effective for weight loss, and that's what I'm looking at in this video. Number one, don't drink calories, including sugary soda and fruit juices. Added sugar has become a big problem in our diet, but sugar in liquid form is even worse. Studies show that liquid sugar calories may be the single most fattening aspect of the modern diet. For example, one study showed that sugar-sweetened beverages are linked to a 60% increased risk of obesity in children for each daily serving. Keep in mind that this applies to fruit juice as well, which contains a similar amount of sugar as soft drinks like Coke. Eat whole fruit for sure, but fruit juice should not be an everyday drink. On that note, to lose weight, you should drink water, especially before and after meals. Drinking more water helps to keep your stomach feeling full, which in turn helps to reduce appetite. One study showed that drinking a half liter or 17 ounce bottle of water about half an hour before meals helped dieters eat fewer calories and lose 44% more weight. Interestingly, in this controlled trial in 62 overweight and obese women who were doing a weight loss program for 24 weeks, they found those who swapped out diet drinks, sugar-free drinks, for water after their lunch lost more weight and had improved blood glucose and insulin levels. So yeah, the takeaway is try to drink more water than any other beverages, uh, including sugar-free beverages. Number three, keep healthy food around in case you get hungry. Keeping healthy foods close by can help prevent you from eating something unhealthy if, when, food cravings occur. Now, a few snacks that are easily portable and simple to prepare include whole fruit, uh, a handful of nuts, baby carrots, yogurt, or a hard-boiled egg or two. Preparation and planning is very important when it comes to weight loss. Number four, use smaller plates. Using smaller plates has shown to automatically help people eat fewer calories in some studies. Now, it's kind of like a, a trick, but it seems to work. For example, which of the following plates looks more full to you? The one to the right, of course, but actually both dishes contain exactly the same amount. Now, psychologists have been studying this phenomenon and it really works for those who want to lose weight. Do you often use really large plates or bowls at home? They look really nice, but they do make you eat more, so swap them out. Number five, lift weights. One of the worst effects of dieting and intentional uh, calorie restriction is that it can cause muscle loss and a slowdown in metabolism. The best way to prevent this from happening is to do a form of resistance exercise like lifting weights or body weight exercises. Now studies show that weightlifting can help keep your metabolism high and prevent you from losing precious muscle mass. Of course, it's not just important to lose fat. You also wanna make sure that what is beneath looks good. Now doing some sort of resistance exercise is critical for that. Number six, get good sleep. Sleep is highly underrated, but it may be just as important as good nutrition and exercise. Inadequate sleep is one of the strongest risk factors for obesity. In this study, short sleep duration was found to raise obesity risk by 89% in children and 55% in adults, which is massive. Now poor sleep can increase hunger and cravings and cause a biochemical tendency for weight gain by disrupting hunger hormones like ghrelin and leptin. So one of the best ways to do this is to simply plan your evenings uh, to go to bed a bit earlier. Number seven, don't diet, eat healthy instead. One of the biggest problems with diets is that they almost never ever work in the long run. If anything, people who diet tend to gain more weight over time and studies show that dieting is a consistent predictor of future weight gain. Instead of going on a diet, make it your goal to become a healthier, happier and fitter person. Focus on nourishing your body instead of depriving it, and weight loss should follow as a natural side effect. Thanks for watching. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you found it informative, and don't forget to subscribe to the Authority Nutrition YouTube channel by clicking the red subscribe button below this video.